Stacy, here's a small glass and a spoon. Okay. I would like you to get the spoon into the glass without touching the spoon. Okay. No, I can't nope. do that. Right? Let me try. Just once more. <laughs> no, it won't stay in. Now, the secret is that the spoon is a lever. You've studied levers in school? Yes, we have a bit. Ordinarily, it's a lever in which the fulcrum, or the pivot point, is back here. You apply a little force here to get a lot of movement out here. Okay. That's the way you normally use it. But the spoon can also be a lever in another way. If you push down here... The end will come up. Yes. Here's where you apply the force, there's where the pivot point is, and here's where you now get a lot of motion. Okay. That's how you get the spoon into the glass. I didn't say that you couldn't use another spoon. What if you did it like this? Go on around over there at the All end. All right. You set the glass about like that. You take this spoon and you put it under here like that. Oh, I see. And you hit this end. You hit that one. And if you do it right, it should flop right into the glass. Okay. Just no. like that. <laughs> so try that on some of your friends. Okay. Using a spoon as a new kind of lever. Okay, we try it again. Very good. <laughs>